short program a year ago, Elvis Stoiko faced a headline that read, Elvis is dead. It had a profound impact on him. It hit me pretty hard, and then I realized that they have no idea what it's all about. They have no idea what it takes, and if they would know, they'd have to be in my shoes to understand it. So no matter who's out there, I, the only person I can rely on is myself. And, you know, your parents are there and your coaches are there, but when that door shuts, you have yourself and only yourself. And that was the biggest thing that I had learned last year. Sur la glace, on the ice, Elvis Stoico, Canada. A philosophical young man who has been confident ever since his first world championship in 1994. He repeated in 95. And here he is again trying to reclaim his title. Remember, the music he's skating to here is the rock, the Rocketeer. And watch and see how he takes that character. He looked very relaxed at the beginning. He was smiling at the audience, and he's got to have a little bit of his mind thinking about the combination from last year that he missed. And this is it, a triple axle. First. And a triple, totally backward. That was as good as they come. Talk about neat, clean, and controlled. This is straight line step. revolutions here must be 12 or more for both feet. Interesting footwork, and this is where you get into separators for skaters. Todd Eldridge and Elvis Stoiko have done great technical performances, but the real separators are going to be the footwork sequences and the spinning. Now that too was a first rate program, right from beginning to end, not Definitely. a mistake, not a problem. Which his mother Irene cheering him on. Disaster a year ago in Edmonton in the short program. Elvis was seventh after that. Pulled up to fourth. This year, though, a much different story. Eldridge leads. We'll see if he still leads when we come back. Back in Lausanne, Elvis Stoiko awaiting his marks along with Doug Lee on the right, Ushi Kessler on the left. Here you see his triple axle, triple toe combination. The secret here is to keep enough speed in between the two jumps so that you can get a great second jump. And you see him here going up in the air. He lands, keeps the speed, reaches back, good pull back, and he lands it with plenty of rotation. And his first set of marks, the required elements, 5.7 up to 5.9. And the second set of marks ranging from, oh, oh wow, from three five sixes. That's very low. Yeah, the five six is much lower than, than Eldridge, uh, up to a 5.9. And that places Elvis Stoiko Dick right behind Eldridge, so the U.S. champion still leads here at the Worlds. Okay. 